one point Andrew have more than 15 vans for staff minimum wages for his salary for his staff 40 grand a year most of his staff are british white british basically Andrew is a crafted guy but he has a problem just like everyone he has a serious mental health problem challenges now he was involved in an incident that took him to prison and after that prison incident his life went like this boom like that so he decided andrew does not know anything about nigerian culture or like he knows he knows he's from nigeria he know he loves that he's been there before he he was brought up a little bit of his early age before he moved back to the uk and completely grew up here he even to play afrobeat when we go out he has cars so when we go out and i'm playing afrobeat he never enjoyed it because it's not his kind of thing when i see him his life was completely a mess after he came back from prison and for a sample to social media so yeah they are open your obia or new washa see a wabrabu washa see a baby born since so not just wababa church room washa see baby of free nipple to tell any naked come home and yeah papa a friend and say andrea what was an animal on seattle so so allegedly or no no kidnapping gun and need a chef and say a fever and then a down for nigeria and yeah a friend and say selling all night to to me to me me papa our nina dante for 10 good years and yeah papa your friend is a ben samo or no levy or you can or your blogger or the assembly above a tour bunch so at your farm mr andrew at home now in some walk off for a mr andrew who you know and he said andrew no a yard yeah yeah adopted no and you said the panel on an et and also to tell no 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 debbie yeah adopted no and that's just a new panel and then the bet now yeah now family now on one day a year andrew a bet now you know a do baby no andrew a picky near me be subay be i'm not just a no on one can say you're more one year i'm andrew you'll be at chess or i'll be you see a map or shy sa abrabona say a wo a uk a match as well or your ex convict a wo uk honomo a idea of that a fear say now or that honomo no a wo ye ye no no 2021 and obey pmo a wo nigeria so obey pmo a nigeria no a just one i'm crumpler and say be a year gun a two a b not just a ordinam a wo honomo odi numa a wo suma say na the company be able to social media so a year friend is a year black sheep now black sheep company no any assembly yeah but to social media so me think of what you say yeah a year black sheep ninti no a year dear andrew a year near maybe now a year and some are not done for a year been some more dear baba to johnny james said the company a year black sheep need here and cash a year dkk our register here oh a year uk ho or workers are only a juma at the manor now andrew a baby a chemo or kidnapping about you a bisa and i feel so neighbor corny and i just want to buy you a no a free a year a sorrow a bear shift from a man by one no report say at the man nigerian police oh man you know she and no i don't change it let's say about you will be so at the report about the top one this is all your victim our andrew a kidnapping for six good days and move johnny here the woods it's here and you didn't you know i don't for now say according to a summer now down for the other better one since you know andrew i am near my power and nigeria i'm a nigerian police a katakata near my bso or say a fiba and often so a yes selling now or kidnapping or mono every conversation be a call so between a yes selling and often so andrew no or send it the man and down for your baba one different said ben samwali ben samwal at the same brina and abba top ones and so nim young kwa nyo kwa team raya kwa minka was a top top cent as to europe canada us uae austria who send this guy at the abagana with the formal account and as a bank account zp or netherlands or the i do payment ko place and as a app store not download it tap tap sent up on your use promo code at the party financial bonus oh europe has and then it's a tap tap send wallet about the amount you should tap tap send you know over to me a creative wallet was no one says kaka crabe up to fifty thousand ghana cities now they are transactions be a person with the charges beyond so a near to a young cop nanny young cotton some are been some more our yeah andrew yeah when you're the baby queen now down for our nanante for 10 good years never cost so andrew abra boom beer or near brand tv a share so I'm Ben Samuel. I run the news Niger 24 News. Okay. It's a blog, okay. it's a website, and there's we have staff and all that. And Andrew has been my friend for over 10 years. Okay. So I know him. We live in the same community in the UK. And um I know 
I know quite a bit of him. So I visited when I was in Nigeria, and every time I come to Nigeria, I do go to see him in Poracot. So mm. it's quite a very unfortunate um, situation that we're discussing about. But the conspiracy out there and the narrative out there is taking the main focus from the main reason why this thing took place, the alleged incident. Because now I used to accept it that it has happened. Now I'm calling it alleged until Nigerian police come out and speak on this. Do you know, I want you to ask me a question, anything, please, Daddy Freeze, you can ask me anything. When I mean anything concerning this man, anything, and I will be brutally honest with you, and I will give you the answer without iota of a fear. And I'm very constant with it. Go ahead, sir. Andrew, and, graduated in 1989. How true is that? Um, Sorry, I from secondary I'm, school. I'm not going to go back as far as that. I didn't know Andrew then. Okay. So, but I do believe Andrew spent some of his early age in the eastern part of Nigeria. He was born in the UK, and then... The good thing that you guys need to know today, Andrew was actually adopted, okay? And Andrew was raised in Nigeria. He told me this one because he explained his early um, growth uh, when we discussed. So that's all I can say. I don't know about 80 something, I don't know, but I do believe that may be a correct um, event of his okay. life. Let's go into Andrew's predilections. Mm -hmm. um, let's talk about what seems to be the norm. There's an allegation that this is one of the reasons why Andrew had to leave the UK. This same inappropriate handling of a woman. Mm -hmm. How true is that? I would say that is partially completely true partially true okay throw some light on it explain to us why and you has why you... he has he was in jail he went to jail in this country okay he went to jail for slapping a woman i was aware of it and he's a very he's a successful businessman he's a gas heater engineer the fact are there he maintained almost 85 percent of council property in beckinghamshire he maintains schools. He has staff that over 15 staff. At one point, Andrew had more than 15 vans for staff. Minimum wages for his salary for his staff, 40 grand a year. Most of his staff are British, white British, basically. Andrew is a crafted guy. But he has a problem. Just like everyone, he has a serious mental health problem, challenges. Now, he was involved in an incident that took him to prison. And after that prison incident, his life went like this, boom, like that. So he decided, Andrew does not know anything about Nigerian culture. Or like, he knows, he knows he's from Nigeria. He knows he loves that he's been there before. He, he was brought up a little bit of his early age before he moved back to the UK and completely grew up here. He, even to play Afrobeat. When we go out, he has cars. So when we go out on a plane of Kobe, he never enjoyed it because it's not his kind of thing. When I see him, his life was completely a mess after he came back from prison. So that means he lost his businesses. He lost all his businesses. He has to, to because he's maintaining property for the council. And when you oh. maintain property for the council and you have a two years in prison, they will be automatically taken away. This is not Nigeria. Mm. Mm. Okay, so you cannot go and start maintaining property or your company will be responsible for vulnerable people in their buildings. I knew he had this problem, but he's in the UK. He's well, he's well managed here. But this guy suddenly called me one day and said he's moving to Nigeria. I'm okay, like, so you... he moved to Nigeria because he was broke. He was not broke. Whoever told you he's broke, they're lying. He mm. was not mm. broke. He has properties. He has life. But his company, went down so he went into depression and now he, he can't go to america because he can't go to the u.s he can't go to any western country because of mm. his criminal record and he wanted to go to nigeria and reset his life okay 
That is how he moved to Nigeria in, in 2021. Mm. Okay, you can go mm. ahead. Let me not just okay. jump over the case. Okay. There were three cases mm -hmm. that Harris Jackson reported. Selim, yes, please. Um, Afiba and mm -hmm. some other girl who came and said she showed us uh, some injuries that she sustained trying to run away from Andrew. Who, from his property. From his property after it was alleged that Andrew K-I-D-N-A-P-P-E-D her. Mm -hmm. Now, these three stories sound very similar. That's mm -hmm. where I draw my personal suspicion from. I may be wrong, but I'd like you to throw some you are, light on it. You are, absolute, you are absolutely right. Mm. And that is not just the three story. There are more stories. Andrew has thrown a girl out of his balcony in Podakot. Like, throw the girl, throw. The girl had a spinal cord. I want you to listen. It's not easy for me to do this, but I'm doing this so that Nigerian government can learn so that a condemned human being cannot come to Nigeria and do what they want. And, and let me go back again. I'm leaving selling. I'm leaving after B and I'm leaving the other girl. Let me take you back a little bit in Paracot. And that big man of his that say, you know him, don't call his name. They will know about this. Andrew moved to PH. Andrew, the first three months, Andrew was in prison in PH. What did yes. he do? The same thing. Girls reported him for. I want to give you correct invent so that bloggers that are running away with shadows, they will know they are hearing from the right source. And I've been, I put myself out there to change the narrative. Because what would have happened is this. They would have just pushed all this narrative, the case would, and more prisoners can move to Nigeria and do the same thing again. Oh, wow. And no lesson, and no lesson will be learned. No lesson oh, wow. will be learned. Do you have evidence to back your claims? It's not evident. If I have evidence, I was aware of the case, like, totally aware of the cases that he's been to. Hmm. The police in Port Harcourt is aware. The state CID, who gave him a GUN license? The state CID, who gave him a GUN license in 2022? And to return back to Nigeria in 2021, the GUN license that you see on the video that he's given to, they was banned in 2022. They backdated it for him 2016 and they took money from him and he was using this thing to tell it to do the big man i am not coming here to defend him i'm coming here to tell you we have a system that doesn't work now now, now let me ask you a question if you are aware of all these things if you are aware of all these things going on why didn't you talk to him i was speaking to him you don't understand i was Speaking regularly to him, and I was telling him, get settled, marry, marry somebody that can calm you down. Logs of messages, logs of text messages. It's not everything I'll come here and I'll start telling you. Oh, for that kind of a guy that have risen to the pinnacle of management to descend to that level, you have to understand. I was telling him, I was I have my kid. I have been in this, this country for more than 20 something years. I have never seen police van. The back of police, but never seen it. My record is as pure as gold. And I'm telling him, pick a lesson, learn, learn. Stop this thing that you are doing. Get married and live your life. It was not easy for him. But the Nigerian police, the environment he moved back to, encourage him. You give hmm. him a word. You give him a go. When he hung, when he when he hung this girl and he went to cell, they give him his phone. He called me from cell. And he said, I have a problem, blah, 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 blah. I have a, I'm like, what's the problem? He called me from cell out. Are you listening to me? I can hear you. The state CID, if anybody watching in state CID, you guys know what I'm talking about. It was a big, wow. big shot. Just imagine you are a big shot in, 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 in Port Harcourt. There are police, police respect you and they come to you. Wow. 
Of so, course, we'd like to hear from the side of the police. We'd like to hear from the side of the police. We, we, we want to hear the whole story. Let me tell you, let me, let me, let me tell you, let, for those of you guys that are saying, why didn't you report to police? Why didn't you, are you, are you, I, me calling police, police, Nigerian police and say, this person is doing this? He's doing with adults. He's having adult, adult conversation with another adult. No matter how rough it is, he's an adult. If I see minor, that would have been a different thing. I'm a crafty writer. I would have written a, a petition against him to the Interpol. Already he was declared wanted here, which I myself, he never revealed that one to me that he was declared wanted in the in the UK. Mm -hmm. So when that incident happened, I thought this would taught him a lesson. But the peer, the DPO that was in charge of that case in Portacot in Agui Road, and I'm giving figures now. Agui Road, Portacot Police Station was coming to Nakandu at home. The one that was supposed to be in charge of disciplining him for harming that girl. That is, if I'm correct. The girl that was thrown from the balcony. Yes. The girl that was thrown from the balcony, a poor girl, a poor girl from your eye cried. But there are things, there are traumas you see in life that you are, you are, now, you are let, thinking. Now, let me ask you, yeah. what happened to the girl? Is she okay now or she... I have no clue. I don't have, I don't have a contact with these, these girls. He, he will tell me the story and then I'll hear the story. Some of his staff will tell me the story. He has staffs. The guy started a betting company. He has computer, and then he he do a lot of betting in millions. So Andrew, now I want to ask you a question, and let let let's let's narrow down to Black Sheep, his company. Yeah. Was Andrew? Do you think Andrew was working with a syndicate? He's uh, not working you, for no syndicate. Do I don't know where. Think, he, he was trafficking O-R-G-A-N-S. Of what? O-R-G-A-N-S. No. I, not that I'm aware of. And I can tell you this from a pure... That company is registered in the UK, in a company house in the UK. So, when I hear that one from your platform, I'm like, where did they get this one from? When mm. I hear that he's... It was just my suspicion. No, it's... I, I've been hearing it. When I hear that there was this chopping human be, I'm like, where did they get this one from? I will come here and tell you there is a lot of narrative that would have just gone under the carpet and the bigger picture, the bigger message would have gone lost completely. And my mission, I want Nigerians to take this very serious. My mission is that Nigerian police must stop being compromised. They must protect our women. When a poor girl come and report to you, Take it serious. Don't sweep it under the carpet. They enable him for this. You talked about the girl that Harrison spoke about, about the young lady that said he has to throw, him, throw herself out of the stairs, out of whatever, in January, whatever. If that girl report would have taken serious, Andrew wouldn't have a, get a chance to harm the other girl in April. That, girl that girl's be... report, let me ask you, yes. uh, the one who jumped, they yes. said Andrew would forcibly do front and back is that I got, no, I got no clue on that one in short to be to be honest with you i I'm, I'm gonna be real honest. i never hear about that one until that one came up but that girl also went to the police station when that girl when the story came out and i read it and i read it on harrison page that girl also went to the police station. what did police do police have a chance to stop this guy one million time before this time around so i'm not coming here to cry for the dismiss of Andrew. I'm coming here to talk about the decay in our system whereby we protect the rich over the poor. That's why I'm came. Because if I didn't speak, that is freeze. If I would if I would have just kept quiet, if I didn't call just Adotu and told her I was driving just Adotu to London, to central London, and I showed her and I'm like do you hear the story going on? He said, she didn't know about the story. I'm like, this is what's going on. I said, do you know this guy is from our city here? And this guy is a person that I know very well. He said, what? I open my phone. I show her. I said, please, we want to highlight this thing. And my focus was not just to find the young ladies that are missing. I want lesson to be learned because that is what the Western country do. Why did this happen? Hmm. Okay. Now, let's, let's hone in on... Um... Celine and Afiba. 
what mm -hmm. do you know about Selena and Afiba? On the on the eighth of May, around midnight, I got a couple of messages from Andrew around twelve twenty four precisely. And everything I'm saying, go to the to the blog, go to, go to my page. The screenshot, everything is there. I got a message. Hey, buddy, this is my last message to you. I am going. It has been a challenge for me. I just want to tell you that I'm done. I'm like, so what do you mean? I wrote him immediately. That was on the 8th, midnight of May. I started writing him, what's up? What's going on? Are you okay? Is it money? What's going on? Oh, Ben, you don't understand. I've been struggling. This is just the last straw for me. The messages are there. The, the catalog of messages are there. I'm like, what is going on? Talk. Then he didn't talk. The next time he talked to me, I called him. He didn't pick up. Then he talked to me. Then he said, the police barricaded me. I'm inside. I'm like, what's going on? He said, I'm inside. He said, I barricade myself inside. I'm like, no. Is it about the, is it about the GUN? If you're about GUN, give it to them. What is going on? So the next thing he did, pa, 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 he sent me, um, he sent me a screenshot. I didn't have time to even check the screenshot properly. I was just trying to come communicate with him to make sure he didn't do the undoable at that particular time. I said, don't take your own uh, life. Don't do it. Don't do it. What's going on? Then I go into the message. Then I saw a screenshot of um, not selling. Yeah, selling. Selling, um, selling an Afiba conversation where he was negotiating price with them. Say, come and spend weekend with me. And then and the girl was asking for one million. Uh, for both of them and i look at it then i ask hold on guys because nigerian job like to jump with falsehood i don't do falsehood not me i i write i said is it about girls please don't do something stupid hand over yourself to the police if they're outside that's what i wrote then he, he no no talking again so at that particular time they said there was about 30 police people in his compound and, I'm, and I was, I keep on trying to check on him. I'll call him, he won't pick. Then say, buddy, I can't talk. He'll write me, I can't talk. My battery can't talk. At that particular time, they say he barricaded himself inside his room. And then the police are outside at the gate and everywhere. So they are coming to arrest him at that particular time. So this is a, I, I was thinking, is there anybody with you? In my head, I'm like, this guy have taken a hostage. I said, this guy have taken a hostage. I know he has GUN. So hmm. I'm now thinking now, what is the best way to talk to him to make sure the damage is not bigger? I said, hand over yourself to the cops. Hand over yourself to the cops. He didn't talk to me again. He did, and I was waiting. I didn't go to bed until about 2 something. 2, maybe 2.45 a.m. I decided to close my eye. In the morning, I write him. No answer. At that time, they have taken him. So hmm. I was... I was was later told that he submitted himself at 3 a.m. in the night to the police. So that means my conversation that I had with him, where I was telling him, don't do something stupid, that actually works. Because he has his GUN inside his room with him. He could have done undoable. But I didn't know there was this guest. Well, I thought the guest, well, he holds the girl hostage. I didn't know the guests were missing. And I did not know the girl were missing until the 22nd of me from the eighth till the twenty second. Yes, yes i did not hear anything anymore so i thought the un unthinkable has happened i was communicating with everybody i know that could reach out to him huh. i call his huh. i call his auntie that i have the contact i text messages i sent the number to my people in nigeria to call with a local number if they will pick up nobody talked now when I saw my Ben Samuel, I did a bit of talk about it. So I saw video, no. Then I got to have a problem with TikTok, X, Instagram, Facebook, but be a, I had a part TV. Me didn't, I am Miss Amma at the private sounds of Asia, Makram. Mr. Mankwa, me wa fasi wa se ni ska bani e di e we ni project no. I saw the be a me wa fasi kama ni e wa problem. E na mre mu. Na monte tap tap send enka. Eh no so ne di e. Tap tap send e easy, fast and secure do e a. Who bet me a send this a carefully a man on it? Aba Ghana bank account and as a mobile money account. Won't you transfer fee be a? Sir, I will be any say. She and his own co-app store and our play store. On download the tap tap send app. 
or download ya e be busan so promo code o ma the pet tv shim o be nya 5 euros 5 pounds and i said 10 dollars on his first transfer and you make kwakwa ko fra na ka chire ta bi mi nya nwie e san say tap tap send e the good news aba tap tap send the gina ne customers won't e or the tap tap send wallet aba i know be any say so your customer who are you kiss is here we bet me a call tap tap send app no no wa create to wallet or so and to say rate in the cost right now this is car go wallet no and i say po bet me a to susu nka kra nka kra and to abere sema o person o send this car bagana no no answer was send this car na bagana and i say o ba o my gana mu what me a you su sika e wa wallet no no tie 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 and you say to say you su mama o gana ha e no so pepe pepe say see a tap tap send that trainer shame Copy them with United Arab Emirates, Netherlands, and Austria. Tap tap send them now. Pop, pop, no, no.